Santa Cruz, Charlie Foxtrot, Mike, Mike, Echo, uh, 3,800, climbing 1, 2,000, runway heading off Boise. We're just pulling into San Francisco where we're going to be meeting Aaron Lusa to do some trials riding in the city. Yeah, great flight, great pilot, smooth sailing, no turbulence. The uh, reason we chose San Francisco, one, is Philly. Um, I've been there to ride BMX multiple times. I've filmed stuff for, for, for an X Games part. So I knew going back there with the trials bike would make for you know, some good riding. I've known Aaron Lutzer for, actually, for years. But we, I think we met in passing, but this week, it was the first time we ever got to ride together. Hey, and we got to have a good session. We got to learn some, just some, like, some basic things from him. So it was good to get some feedback from him and learn, learn a bit about trials in general. My name's Aaron Lutzi. I'm from Portland, Oregon, and I'm a mountain bike trials rider. San Francisco was a place that I always came to growing up, and there's so much riding to be done here. There's so much stuff to do, whether it comes to mountain biking, street riding, a little bit of everything. And so I've always come back here to just ride whatever the city has to offer. And every time I come here, there's always something new that I've never seen before that kind of comes out and, and I'm able to ride. So San Francisco is the city that always delivers something every time you come here. Nice, one and done. We mostly rode down by the port. You know, a lot of the very touristy areas, places that are just they were close to the hotel. We didn't have to, you know, do a big commute. That's one of the challenges of riding around on the street trials bike. It's a small gear ratio. So it's, we're doing three times the work to get around. So Aaron did a great job at, of, you know, finding spots that were closed. I've been following Brad since the early days of Ride BMX when he was riding for Hoffman and Target and doing these massive bunny hops and all these huge moves. Yeah, I think the trials community has been really interested to see what he's all about. He's got a trials bike and he's got this really cool background and so to see the two things kind of come together is super exciting for all of us. Yeah, I do enjoy riding the bike. It, it's a definitely a big challenge for me because you can make it as dangerous as you want. And one thing about it, I'm not used to having, I haven't ridden brakes on, on, a, like on a street bike, you know, having a super hard stopping power from using my shoes, I'm just burning holes, you know, dragging my feet down the hill. It's a, it's a nice change to have brakes too. I like being able to slow down. It's a YouTube channel and it's all about teaching people all the basics of trials riding. So people watch these videos of Brad or Danny or Fabio, whoever, they get excited about what's happening and they wanna learn that kind of stuff. They can go to this channel and learn all the basics, how to get started as a trials rider, how to advance as a trials rider. And that's a big part of kind of what I'm trying to do with that channel. So next on the trip, we're, we're gonna fly out to Winter Park, Colorado. We're gonna link up with uh, Samantha Soriano. There'll be some park riding, hopefully maybe some, you know, some different trails off the beaten path, do a bit of that. Maybe we'll see a moose. <laughs>